So, um, Parsec Smart Silent Monitoring and Whisper application for Cisco Call Manager allows you to silently monitor and whisper uh, monitor agent during a conversation between an agent and a customer without the customer or the agent knowing that he is being monitored. So it has got mainly two features. One is the monitoring an agent and the second is the whispering or coaching an agent in case where in a coaching and the supervisor can coach or silently monitor an agent whenever there's a call going on between the agent and the client. So just let me demonstrate this application to you. So this is the web interface using which uh, the super admin configures the different parameters of the application. So uh, here all the different supervisors and the agents they are configured out here. So that, uh, it supports both extension mobility and non-extension mobility uh, feature of the call manager. You need to define groups where in a groups where you need to assign the different agents and supervisors. You can have multiple supervisors for a group. So let me straight away go and log in as a supervisor. To so I will log in as a supervisor which I have created for demonstration purpose, the demo super. So all the different groups that have been assigned to this particular supervisor are displayed on the left hand side of the screen. So on clicking of a group name, all the different agents along with the status is being displayed. There as you can see that there are multiple agents out which have been assigned to this particular supervisor and their status. So there are few of them which are just busy that means these agents are busy talking to some client. So I can even filter those agents uh, with a status based on the status. So by the status, by I can see as yes. so I can view them the which are the agents they are currently busy. So whenever I start monitoring, uh, the call initiation or the activation of the monitoring is done to the web UI, but the voice is done through a Cisco IP phone. So for this case, I have a Cisco IP communicator on my laptop. So whenever I start monitoring, the uh, the voice will come, monitoring voice will come through this IP communicator on my laptop. So on click of any of the agent, you can see the monitoring started and, and this voice I'm getting through this phone which is being configured for this particular supervisor. So right now I'm initially in a monitoring mode now in case I want to coach or whisper to the agent, all I did need to do is just unmute my phone. And once I unmute the phone, I can simply whisper to the agent. So in a whispering mode, the customer won't know that I'm speaking to the agent. It's only the agent can hear my voice. But in a monitoring mode, and neither the agent and neither the client or a person to whom the agent is talking to can hear my voice. To stop the monitoring, either I can disconnect the call on my phone this way or I can simply stop it using the screen and stop options out here. There's an option of as continuous monitoring. Like in case the supervisor wants to continuously monitor a particular agent, he can do so by selecting the continuous monitoring option. And so you can also see the different status for call in case there's a, a even a ring status. The ring status has been displayed. You can see. The ring status, I can see that even 2061 was busy right now. So I can even monitor this agent. So this application doesn't require neither the UCCX, it's not required. And 
even it supports mobile devices uh, your Cisco mobile 7925 phones so, so even a monitoring can be initiated using the Cisco IP phone also in using this application you can also monitor agent without the web UI just using your Cisco IP phone so you need to all you need to do is access the IP phone service based application on your phone here I have been configured as the Mars silent monitoring whisper application on selecting the service you will be prompted to enter the DN of the agent to whom you want to monitor so here I'll just enter DN so I'll just select 2122 that's a DN so on clicking of submit I start in a monitoring phase so it does you see you have two options of monitoring either through a web UI or through the IP phone so you can monitor or whisper to an agent using both these interfaces